A seamless transition in cinematic video is a technique that creates a smooth and invisible cut between two shots, making the video more engaging and professional. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can create an eye-catching in-camera seamless transition in just a few minutes. Let me introduce the video clips placed on the timeline inside Premiere Pro. In the first video, I have recorded a camera movement resembling a panning shot, transitioning from the road into the train. Toward the end of the video, the view in the program monitor becomes invisible as the camera moves close to the train window and its seats, resulting in an invisible ending. In the second video, I panned the camera to the left side, moving close to the train door to create another invisible ending for the video. To achieve in-camera seamless transitions, it's important to complete about 70-80% to of the work during the video shooting process. Now let's navigate to the fast footage and find a frame from the invisible area to make a cut. Utilize the razor tool from the toolbar. Click here to execute the cut, then switch back to the selection tool to remove the excess portion of the video that will not be used. Finally play the video to observe the changes. Next, choose the best segment from the second footage, move the time indicator gradually to find a frame for trimming the footage. Hit the key on the keyboard to access the razor tool and make the cut. After that hit the VQ to return to the selection tool and delete the surplus video. Finally drag the first footage near the second footage to seamlessly match them for a seamless transition. There is an issue with the invisible areas in both footage at the ending part. However, to achieve a smooth and seamless cut between these two shots, we need to close them together. To do this, right click on the second footage and select Spread or Derosion. Then enable Reverse Spread and click OK. This action effectively reverses the second footage, bringing the invisible area from the end to the beginning. Now play the video and then you notice that our transition is nearly seamless. Manual adjustments may be necessary to achieve perfection. Apply the cross dissolve transition in the transition area to seamlessly blend it. Right click on the edge of the video and select apply default transitions. Alternatively go to the effects, type cross resolve in the search box and apply the transition from there to the video. Play the video a few times and adjust the length of the transition for the best results. Now let's apply transition sound effects to enhance engagement. Navigate to the window menu to enable the AOGIS plugin. I intend to utilize a free sound effects pack from this plugin. Scroll down to locate the free sound effects pack and you can find the download link for this plugin in the description. Click on the pack and go to the paper category. From the 28 sound effects in this category, let's choose the best one for our seamless transition. This particular sound effect seems suitable, so I apply it by double clicking on it. Our transition sound effect is placed on the timeline. Expand the audio layer by double clicking exactly here to view the waveforms bigger. Position the sound effects under the transition area and make necessary adjustments and such as modifying its duration. It's recommended to preview the changes made. To add a unique touch, right click on the sound, select speed and duration. Reverse the speed and click OK. Play the transition sound effects and position it where it fits best. Optionally decrease the volume level. Apply the constant power at the beginning of the audio to create a fade in effect. These minor creative adjustments are sufficient to enhance the sound effects. I believe that this tutorial on transitions can assist you in improving the quality of your videos. That's all for today's sessions, I'll be back in the next video.